And Ron, we've just sort of been on repeat. I mean, we keep having these chances every single day. Uh, yeah, you know, and it's going to be another day today. We have that marginal risk of severe weather. Uh, one of the big things that I've been noticing is right here. The dew point has been very high over the course uh, of the last couple of weeks. Right around the 70 degree mark has been fairly common, and that's uh, a, a measure of moisture at the surface. The higher the dew point, the more moisture there is to work with. It also energizes our atmosphere, so moist air is more uh, or has more energy than drier air. So the more moisture you have, the more chance or likelihood you have as you're heading into the afternoon to see some strong storms developing today. Once again, that uh, that explosiveness is uh, already primed with the dew point coming in at 70 degrees. You also can't see your temperature falling below the dew point, so the temperature is at 71 right now with the dew point coming in at 70. Wind is calm as we're starting off, but we will be looking at winds between 5 to 10 miles an hour for your afternoon. They'll be coming in out of the southwest. Here's a look at those temperatures for you. We do have Franklin at 69 degrees, but everyone else pretty much into the 70s. Once again, uh, you can look at those temperatures and you know that your dew point is at least uh, a couple of degrees below that. So if you are into the 60s, you do have some dew points that are actually in the 60s. Most are right at or just below the 70 degrees. Mark already seeing some rain showers around the Akron area. They saw more than two inches of rain yesterday being recorded at the Akron Airport. A couple of spot showers here locally right around just to the south of Altoona, but that's really about it as we're starting off our day. More spot rain showers down to our southwest. You can see the clouds already there. Here's where all of that moisture is, and as it comes together, sliding off to the northeast, that's where our chance for severe weather and strong storms is going to come from. Now, I will say this. We do have the marginal risk of severe weather. Wouldn't be surprised that that level one out of five is bumped up to a slight risk later on today. When will we see that? Well, I think that we're going to be really watching radar and satellite very closely. Once we start to see development, that's when we could see that bumped up just a little bit to a slight risk. Why isn't it already? Well, I think one of the big reasons for that is that data continues to show us not seeing a lot in the way of any storms. We do have what we call a cap a layer, a stable layer right on top of us today. If that is uh, kind of breached, if we start to see those storms popping, then we'll likely see us bumped up to a slight risk of severe weather. So we'll continue to see a chance for some strong storms today. Another chance for some strong storms tomorrow. High temperature today about 85 degrees is what we are expecting to see and your UV index coming in at an eight today. That's important because that means our burn time is down to around 15 minutes. So make sure you put on that SPF 30 or higher if you're having uh, being outside today. Here's a quick look at those expected high temperatures today. I don't have a lot of time, so I want to quickly go through our bus stop forecast C grade for this afternoon with some strong storms around. Here's your seven day 85 today, 84 your Tuesday high. 82 on Wednesday and then temperatures near 90 Thursday and Friday for highs.